Fuck is that? that noise let me live please ah. eat that gas wipe You go first. I'll cover you. Where the fuck is this? Hey, guys! Bob Roots escaping! Where the fuck?
your ass over here, Vito. Vito, they fucked me up pretty good. I think I need a doctor. Okay. Let's get you over to El Greco. Lady, come on. Get out of the car. Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! I didn't do anything to you! Look out! Hey, I can make it. What do you want me to do with the money? Take it to Bruno. All right. At least that'll be out of the way. Good evening, gentlemen. Oh, what happened to you? Hey, Doc. I got my ass kicked at... <coughs> I'm coughing up what blood. What is happening today? One of your uh, guys is already here. Uh, Who? His name is Antonio Balsamo. Tony Balls? What happened to him? Somebody messed him up pretty good. Uh, I don't think uh, he's ever going to uh, walk again. What? <laughs> this surprises you? All the blood. Uh, all the death. Uh, this is the lifestyle you choose. Uh, uh, One day your luck is bound to run out. Uh, the next time, it could be you. And off with the sermon, Doc. You have time to treat Joe? Yes. But you'll have to wait a minute while I fix Antonio up. That's okay, Doc. All right. Come in. Make sure you settle things with Bruno, okay? And Vito. Thanks. Sure thing. Feel better. Breaking news on EDLT Delta Radio. It's the old disc jockey slash news commentator slamming Sammy Stevens bringing you news from Midtown. Construction site carnage. Well, that's what the papers might call it tomorrow. Witnesses have reported the sound of automatic weapons coming from the building and at least one body falling from a high-rise scaffold to the sidewalk below. Police arrived as a car was leaving the site and they are still in pursuit of that vehicle. It's safe to say that if you see some flashing lights coming from behind you, Pull over and duck, baby. For EDLT Radio, I'm slamming Sammy Stevens. Hey, I need to see Bruno. Got the money? Yeah. Come on in, then. You're lucky. We were just about to leave. Good evening. You have the money for me? Or do you wish to extend the deadline? Here it is. <laughs> I have to admit, this is somewhat of a surprise. I heard you boys had some... complications. Yeah, we did. I heard that Henry is dead. I'm very sorry to hear that. Isaac, count it. So your little business venture was a success? You got your money, right? Right, right. It's just that the whole city has been turned upside down. The Chinese think the Italians attacked them, so they're going after Vinci. That's not good. Not good. Would that have anything to do with the reason you borrowed this money? Sorry, Bruno. That's none of your business. Uh, thank you, Isaac. It looks like the debt is settled. I don't even know your name. Vito. Vito who? Vito Scaletta. Eh, Scaletta. I knew a Scaletta once. But I must say, you're much better at paying back your debts than he was. His poor wife had to do it for him. So it was you who lent my father the money. <laughs> your father. Ah, like father, like son. I see you don't approve. But I didn't make him borrow the money, now did I? Just like I didn't make you. If you ever need a loan, you know where to find me. <laughs> sure. <laughs> 